Hello again everyone. Well I've had an idea that's been brewing for a while to tie in the airbrushing paintings with the motorhome aspect of the channel. I've made myself up a nice steel blank in the usual way and this time it's a bit bigger than usual. I've sprayed it with some matte black paint. It still fits pretty well on my easel. Right, next I need to cut out the picture of our van. Now I'm going to work out where I want it on my picture and stick it on with my old trusty magnets. First though, I'm going to give this a wipe down with a bit of tack rag. background done. I'm going to take off this little shield now and we'll keep that for when we fill in the motorhome. Well it's a few days later and looking at this I think the main large planet needs a bit more colour to it. So I'm going to mask up the motorhome shape again and touch that in with the blue and give the clouds a bit more shape and highlights, I think, if I can. Right, so well now I'm going to cut out the dark areas, the window, the grill, the wheel arches and such, and I can just blow in sort of a white cover, I think, for the main body of the van. Okay, so it's a couple of days later again and I'm back on this 
And what I want to do next, I think, is the light and radiator grill area. Now, because that's obviously got to have a, a nice sharp edge, I'm going to mask everything up again, except for that. And we'll try and get that sort of almost charcoal grey colour mixed up and I'll spray that in. Now while I've got that black in the airbrush, I'm going to put in some of the fine detail around the front. I'm going to do that by making an acetate shield.
Well, we're back on this. It's been a few days. I didn't get a chance to do any painting on it over the weekend because I was at the Caravan Camping and Motown show. You may have seen my video. Anyway, time to get back to it. Well, this is my lovely reference photo and I think what I need to do now is get some of these other fine lines in. I want to start with the line of the body of the cab against the coach built section. Maybe do the top bit there as well. And that's quite a fine line and it's also not that dark. In reality it's supposed to be white mastic but it's gone a little bit grey with age. So it's not as, as harsh as some of these other lines. So I'm just going to do a sort of a, a single cut and we'll see if we can just spray a light bit in there. Might make it a bit thicker in some of these areas, but uh, yeah, let's see how we get on. And don't forget, there's a selection of my airbrush paintings available in my Etsy shop. Just search in Etsy for TTXELA airbrush. I'll put a link in the description below. Just drawn the outline of the window so I can locate my line nice and easily when I put this piece of acetate up against the painting. Well, I'm going to cut out the door handle and this little bottom bit for the wing mirror next because I think I can get them blocked in and it'll help locate everything else. Thank you. 
Well, that's the progress so far. I'm reasonably pleased with it. You can definitely see that it's our motorhome, but there's still quite a lot to do. Well, I hope you enjoyed it and keep an eye out for part two. Well, that's all for now. If you enjoyed it, press like. Subscribe if you want to see some more. And ring the bell to be notified when we upload something new.